Yo, bro. You no, know, I wish I had a cool nickname like Firehawk. I wonder what mine would be. Like Stone Wolf. Or Underwear Chief. Welcome, you're watching Headset VR, welcome to the channel, welcome to another gaming video. Now today I'm going to be playing a little bit of Borderlands 3, now I'm going to be playing this in UE VR. Now what I would like to do, and mainly the big reason for doing this video, is because the way you actually play this game in UE VR has actually changed. Good news, it's easier, even better news. I'm going to show you exactly what to do. Now, first of all, I'm using an RX 7900XTX GPU, a Ryzen 9 7900 CPU. I've got 32GB of RAM, and we're using a Quest 3 headset with the official Oculus Link. Now, first of all, you need to join the Flat to VR Discord. So, open up a web page and just type in Flat to VR Discord. Flat and then go on flat to VR Studios. And well, it should just give you an invite. As you can see, I've been invited to join. Right, so you click on when it says Browse Channels. And then from here, you can scroll down and look at all the channels that you can potentially look to join. So what we need to do is join this one that says Unreal Engine VR. And then once you've joined that channel, we'll then go into the games. Now don't forget, it does say to start here first, so you may want to look there first. But otherwise, once you've got the UE Games channel open, if we just scroll down, and you can see just here, if I open this up, that you can see all the games. Type in the name of the game. Obviously, in this case, we want Borderlands 3. So then, from there, if you click on the game name, it'll give you a full screen. And if you look on the pin messages, it'll show you a few profiles and other important suggestions. So you go into the pin section, that's where you'll see profiles, guides, and this is the profile just here. So you need to download that profile and then go to wherever you've downloaded that profile to. As for me, it's just in my download section. So what we're going to do is minimize this down. And we've got UEVR opened up. Okay, so we've downloaded UEVR, we've downloaded the profile. What we need to do is make sure that we start it all properly. So let's import the profile. So go to where you've put the Borderlands 3 download. Plus, press on open and it should give you this DLL warning. Just click yes. And then minimize that down. Now this little pull down here, when you start the game up, the game name will appear in there. So let's start the game up. And we need to make sure that we're in OpenXR. So there we go, we can choose Borderlands 3. And what you do now is wait for the section with Claptrap. And we need to inject on or before. So we're going to do that on the section for Claptrap. Now, if it's worked, it should give you the image in your headset, which it has. Okay, right, so we're in game and I've just been having a bit of a, a fool around with some of the controls because 
Now in this game, they've implemented some gesture controls. I hold the grip down and swing like that. You've got to aim kind of the reticle at what you're aiming at and it'll give you a melee swing. Now also, if I get my left grip and I aim between my shoulder blades and grip, it goes into the inventory like this. And if I go left grip and waist, or should say hip, it goes into map. Now there are a couple of others that are supposed to work. I've not had any success with them. And that's supposed to be things like right grip and waist or hip as well, which doesn't actually seem to do anything, which is un unfortunate because that's like one of the other, other weapons that you can potentially use. Um, there's also right grip and chest, which is to Thought grab had one. grenades. As you hear from that, I don't actually have a grenade, so it won't let me grab a grenade. So left grip and chest does actually work and you need to release grip to throw. So do be careful when using that one. Now there are a couple of things you can do, which I haven't actually tried as yet. So let's give this a try. So if we shoot a couple of times, and it says if I use my left grip below the gun, it'll reload, which it does. Which is really cool. Now, these are all up in the Flat to VR Discord. These instructions and controls are clearly laid out. I mean, this is definitely, without doubt, one of the best experiences you're going to get in UEVR, without a doubt. So, like I say, let me just be clear. If you want a fantastic VR experience from a flat screen game, then Borderlands 3 in UEVR is absolutely without doubt one of the best games that you will play. We have got six off motion controllers, as you can see. We have got. Oh. We've got gesture based melee. As you can see, I can melee the floor. Let's just check it on. Yep, as you can see, I can melee that there. This is an absolutely impeccable, absolutely impeccable UEVR profile. So if Borderlands 3 is your kind of game, even if it's not your kind of game, it's fucking unbelievable. It really is unbelievable. Whoa. Let's check out Malia Tash. from oh okay not figured out the actual range on that thing yeah
done there. Um, need to pinch one of these cars. I can't remember how I pinched it last time. Woo! Oh no. Center. Watch out for those so-called twin gods. From what I hear, Tyrene Calypso is the star of the show. Her brother Troy runs the cult's propaganda. P.S. They both suck. Just saying. Okay, this looks absolutely bonkers. Of course, it is Borderlands. And now that I've shown off what it can do, if you can support the channel, that would be absolutely fantastic. If uh, you wanna see more VR content on the channel, then do subscribe and you'll see every video that gets uploaded. And of course, if you wanna see, or if you wanna make any comments, pop them in the usual place, I'll respond to every single comment. And, um, well, I think we're just going to end here. We've tested out a little bit of combat. And we're going to come back and do another video of this. Because this is a really cool profile. And, well, I want to see what else it's got to offer. So, I'm just going to say thank you for watching. This is Headset VR playing Borderlands 3 with melee gestures and there's a few other gestures incorporated which are really cool now i'm gonna have a, a reach out to the mod developer and say that some of them aren't working so maybe we might get a little bit of an improvement but otherwise this is absolutely brilliant the way they're incorporating gestures into uevr is absolutely fantastic it is what we'd like to see in vr games it really is what we'd like to see in VR games, and now we're actually seeing it in games like Silent Hill. We're also seeing it here in Borderlands 3, and it really is, it really is, really is essential that you play these games, because I'll get really sad if you don't. Now, anyway, I'm just going to say thanks for watching. Please do look out for more content on the channel, and we'll catch you for the next video. This is Borderlands 3, played in UEVR, and it is fucking awesome. Do try this out when you can. Oh, piss off. Look for the setup guide at the start. It's dead simple now. Anyway, thank you very much. We'll see you soon, and we'll do the remainder of this broadcast centre next time. Take care, folks. Bye-bye for now. Bye-bye.